Good afternoon, Ms. Mason's class. Okay, so you haven't been in here since we had the Easter things in here. There are a few special things. Do you know how Miss Day in the Media Center gives me the posters? Because, you know, people say to me, it's like, you know, you could be out working, you could be earning money. And, and they'll say to my husband, it was like, doesn't it bother you that she doesn't bring a paycheck home? And, you know, but I get paid in hugs. And, and what I do is so much more rewarding. I mean, I used to work in retail business. I used to work in the school system, you know, but I didn't retire from anything. Most of my life I've been a, a mom, a wife, a grandmother, you know, and so, I love being There's here. I mean, and for a couple basket. years, my grandsons actually went here. So it, that was like a double, I I you know, I would get to have breakfast or lunch with them. Really and, cool, like and so cars, I, Atwater is just home. Vehicles. There's some Barbies and strawberry shortcakes here. There are, let me see what other cool she's, things. I've... She's just uh, amazing. Like, I don't know how to describe it, but it's beyond the most special world in, and you can film word what in the you're world. Doing? It's like you can make your own little mini movie. There's so many things that she has her, she has her hand in so many different areas and so many different pots and you know anytime anybody calls her for help she's always the first one there. She never ever worries, you know, she puts whatever she needs to do on the back burner to help everybody else and we just love her so much. So, um, with what Miss Mason gave you, then we were gonna gift you 50, okay? Well, so I have kids that get off the bus in the morning and as soon as they get that, off the bus okay? they're on their way to breakfast. They know to stop in the store and get their hug. You know, I mean, just different times during the day, I'll have kids and say, Mrs. Lord, can I have lunch with you today? And we take turns and, and try to just spend that special time. And, um, you know, so when they have something going on that they don't, they won't necessarily tell their teacher, they'll, they'll come tell me. And, and then I can share information if I need to and, you know. We'll have these. But um, the hugs are the best. I mean, all right. So you, you tell Miss Mason that you still have that many left, okay? Okay. Mrs. Lord gives stuff to all the kids, and without her, all the kids here would be very grumpy. The kids here look forward to coming here and ha having getting hugs, hugs from her, and shoes and clothes, and it makes their day. Oh, hey, I have something that your sister would like. Look what I found. It does, because kids have become comfortable enough to me that they'll come up and they'll whisper in my ear, Mrs. Lord, I'm hungry. And so then I can take one of our red little Atwater backpacks and put some food in it to just give them to take home that day. And we do the program that they do, there are kids that take food home on Friday, but during the week, it's like any time they come to me, it's like my mom can't make it to the pantry. And I'm like, okay, let's go to the pantry and we'll pick out some things. And then they just take it home on the bus with them. I don't have any more yo-yos right now. Yeah, absolutely. I really think she's part of the heart of our school. Um, you know, not only does she do things to help, but she really does care about the students and about the staff members, and she'll do anything she can for you. It's good that we don't spread germs, right? Right. 165. I mean, this is one of those things that if you came in... If I try to stay home and I try to do my own errands, it's like I'll get a call and it was like, oh, so-and-so needs shoes or something. I'm, I'll be right up, you know. And okay. um, the smiles on their faces because sometimes it's like you give a child a new pair of shoes and their shoes are just so torn up. And they'll hug the shoes and they'll say, oh, I get to keep these? And it's like, absolutely, you know. And, and so it's, yeah. It, I love it. Are there too many things for you to pick from? Do you like Littlest Pet Shop? Do you like lambs? What kind of dog is yeah, she this really one? is the heart of Atwater. She two. provides, you know, not only food for the food pantry for our needy families, clothing for our students that, you know, need socks and underwear way. and basic Sorry, necessities that they don't have. And, okay. you know, she really does go above and beyond to help every back? single yeah, person here, here. Staff members, um, students, teachers, everyone. Excuse me, Ms. Ward. This year, our district winner for Outstanding Adult Volunteer of the Year is Susan Lord from Atwater Elementary School. What a cheery section she brought with us tonight. I'm a mothering person, and um, so I love being able to be here and take care of kids and sometimes give them a hug. If their grandma doesn't live here, I, I can kind of step in and be that grandma. She is one very busy volunteer, and we cannot thank her enough for all of her efforts. Congratulations, Susan Lord. Oh, I'm so proud of her. I mean, we always knew that she was our all-star, but it's really nice that she's being recognized by the whole entire county and is getting the recognition she deserves. When he puts the sweater on, he'll notice one of the buttons is loose. 
It's like people just don't have the time. Uh, everyone's lives are so busy. They're working, and if they have children, they're running their children to ball games and things like that. And it's hard to find the time. And sometimes you just have to tell yourself that, like, it's important enough to me to make a difference in a child's life. Show up and let them know that once a week, or once every other week, you'll just spend that half hour with them. And the rewards are overwhelming. I mean, the, the love that these kids give, and, you know, it's, it's the best. And chances are, if you give him the jam, he'll want a muffin to go with it. Okay, what you're going to do now is you're going to walk up slowly and get a place saver from Miss Day so that you can go choose a library book, okay? So go ahead and get your place saver and then start looking for a book.